Here we have some incredible inventions that generate free energy for your home. Number 13. Solar Flower Companies are inventing unorthodox gadgets to use free energy to meet the demand for compactness and mobility. A solar-powered flower is one example. It's a solar panel that unfolds like a fan or attractive plant from a compact shape for convenient carrying, not a magical flower. It's not light like flowers, despite its appearance. Pure carbon fiber weighs 419 naalabs. Moving that by hand would be difficult for personal use, but not for industrial use. The built-in GPS technology lets it follow the sun once it's running. It's common in solar panels and boosts power output to two kilodollars when conditions are favorable. This panel can withstand any weather or strikes. It was designed for extreme situations. Number 12, biogas plant. This invention converts food waste into usable energy. Instead of throwing them away, the barrel-shaped device easily accepts biodegradable trash mixed with sewage through an entrance chamber. After entering, specific microorganisms convert waste to gas. Methane, the gas's main component, provides energy. The gas you create can be used in many ways, but most people cook with it. One gadget for a three-for-ice, five-person family produces enough gas to power a stove burner for over two hours a day. As more micro-recycling farms open, more biogas-using devices will appear. This technology tackles sophisticated conversion, but it only takes 11 SQRF tier and takes one to four hours to assemble. So you can put up this amazing invention practically anywhere without much effort. Saving enthusiasts will love this innovation. It cuts daily cooking firewood or fuel use by 70, 90% and pays for itself in two years. Number 11, Skywolf. Space is a big issue with wind turbines and solar panels. However, Skywolf craftsmen created a hybrid device to solve this problem. Rotating blades distinguish the company's wind turbine. However, its unusual design distinguishes it. It's enclosed and has solar panels. Skywolf's hybrid turbine uses wind and sun energy. Imagine needing less space with a 33-foot tall, 6-foot wide contraption that extracts free energy in two ways. Wind turbines and solar panels are better together. It works as well as solar panels and wind turbines despite its space-saving design. At 20 mSpH, the wind generator generates 50 kilodollars hours and at 40 mm match, 145 kilowatt hours. Plus, it generates energy in 4.5 to 60 mph winds. It can generate energy at 4.5 mph wind speeds, unlike other turbines, which are worthless at that speed. This device generates energy efficiently at 25 dB, quieter than a conversation. Number 10, Meridian Panel. Free energy is fantastic, but a compact mobile solar panel is even better. The ESSA Systems panel is easy to alter, making it ideal for free energy extraction. The easy to fold and unfold design makes it mobile enough to store in confined locations and unfold six times when needed. In addition to mobility, the creators considered efficiency. Depending on the setup, the Meridian panel can supply 1800 to 7000 WS of power. A GPS tracker helps it follow the sun and perform more efficiently. Number nine, the solar panel. Consider installing solar panels in a garage to create free energy for two uses. No doors and one wall make it a unique garage, but it keeps rain out. You may also easily extend the carport to make it a garage. Solar panels on the carport's roof reveal its second use. They create 200 volts per 10 SQF tier, allowing the carport to protect the car from rain and charge an electric car. Extra electricity can be sold or used for other devices to get money from free energy. Number eight, Helix 3 No. Looking at this turbine, you might think anyone would want it on their property since it looks good. However, its value goes beyond appearances. The Loveside turbine is sleek, attractive, and eye-catching. In particular, its vertical axis and spiral design make it fascinating to watch spin. This makes the wind turbine elegant and productive. It can catch wind from every direction and operate well in mild breezes due to its form. Its unusual design generates three cal doublers of energy at 35 metonerast, setting it apart from competitors. The Helix 3.0 developers also protected the turbine. An overload clutch ensures safety in stormy conditions with gusts up to 112 pomamunturns. The turbine is beautiful and efficient. The best part, it's easy to install without tools because it has a transport frame and a completely constructed rotor. Like many wind turbines, the Halix 3.0 can be assembled in virtually as little time as a Lego wind turbine. Number seven, Lego wind turbine. Envelope's shear winds wind energy capture method outperforms turbines. Performance is vital. This turbine's distinctive design, as shown on film, is crucial. 
Due to its distinctive design, it can direct any wind speed into a duct for a boost. Over time, the accelerated wind drives ground-level turbines. Other turbines are six times less efficient than the envelopes. Most turbines struggle with wind speeds below 1 mph, however this turbine can. Number 6. E-Power Cube Perhaps weird, but technologies that harvest free energy for dwellings thrive outside? Example, Wagon Tech Solar Panel Generator. Because camping devices are portable and small, extracting free energy is convenient. You can store the generator with panels in even the smallest space and just use it when needed. This is a good alternative if you don't want a large stationary solar panel taking up space. The makers wanted this little gadget to be mobile and effective. They fared well since the device's five little solar panels can generate 1500 WS in seven to eight hours when unfolded. That should supply enough power for illumination and a few small appliances. The $1,100 device may not be worth it, but it will likely pay for itself. Number five, free electric. Who wouldn't want to generate their energy, especially a fitness buff? An electric bike may work for you. A generator, 12 volt battery, and extra weights are added to regular bicycle parts. We kept things simple so anyone on the globe could fix or service the bike. Just sit and pedal to create electricity. Good thing the battery lets you ride without pedaling. For instance, you can bike to charge the battery during the day and use it for home lights at night. This exercise bike can power a fan, phone charger, and tablet. Its developers say there are two types of electricity generating bikes, $250 for needy areas and $1,200 to $1,500 for richer areas. Free energy, even if it's hard to get, matters more than your bike choice. Number four, core. You need little to get free energy. Look at this pedal-powered contraption. You pedal to generate electricity. Cycling for long durations isn't easy, but with your hands free, you can multitask and take care of other vital things. This generator works well with simpler devices, but struggles with high demand ones. For charging low energy tablets, cell phones, video devices, portable gaming gear and more, it provides 20 WS at 12 VTS. It can charge four phones or two tablets simultaneously. Some items can't be charged from the generator. Therefore, a 12 volt battery may help. With this battery, you can cycle occasionally to store electricity in case the grid goes out. The 12X, 5X, 3-inch, 4-pound device is tiny and light. With these features, you can carry it wherever to charge your devices for free, even if others stare at you while you cycle hard. Number 3. Exorin. Inefficient showering wastes energy. Stop wasting this essential resource with this answer. These easy-to-install heat exchangers capture shower hot water heat. It sounds complicated, but it uses warm water to heat the echo drain's cold water. Separate pipes and double-walled systems keep cold and hot water separate. Reusing energy might save you $1 to $250 each year, depending on your area, according to the eco drain system. Number 2. Thermoelectric generators. Most free energy comes from the sun or wind, but thermoelectric generators are worth understanding about. After reading the scientific details, the term can seem even more puzzling. Simply put, these generators convert heat into electricity. Generators of all sizes need heat. This device powers up on a regular candle at room temperature. A wonderful lighting option. Another thermoelectric generator uses furnace heat instead of a candle. On top, it creates 45 watts, enough to charge phones or other low-power devices. This generator is more appealing, since it looks like a lamp it fits indoors. As with the thermoelectric generator, it may charge your phone or serve as a light fixture. This generator seems futuristic unlike the others. It looks like a futuristic device and can power any device. Number 1. Verdi. This typical model for budget-conscious workout enthusiasts with easy-to-use features. It has a 21x 58-inch treadmill, decreased friction and comfort enhancements. The treadmill allows walking, running, sprinting and sled pushing. It also tracks workouts to help athletes track their progress and improve. The best part is that track running generates electricity. Stepping on the belt rotates the flywheel, providing power. The quantity of energy produced depends on weight, speed, and workout duration. You can create 50 to 250 watts per session. This treadmill generates its electricity to operate off-grid. While running, use excess electricity to charge your phone or other gadgets. The developers say the treadmill powers a fan and TV simultaneously. Did you like it? Tell us what you think of the video in the comments section below and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more interesting videos.